Welcome to Life in the SHL episode 11. It is getting a little cold in Lexand. I think it's uh, 30 degrees Fahrenheit, which is negative one Celsius. So it's cold and it's a two game week. Thursday we're on the road against Lule and then um, Saturday at home against the reigning champs back her. Another fun week. Hope you guys enjoy the episode. We got snow. I don't know if you can even tell. What'd you get, Fox? Rice? Yes, do. What do you say? Thank you. You're welcome. Game day, start day, on the road against Lula. Just a lovely same day flight to the game, but another big three points on the line. Um, two good days of practice. Feeling good, hopefully keep the wind streak rolling. Fingers crossed, knock on wood. Just chilling with Foxy before heading out, right? All right, make sure to pack up the three points. Big win, seven in a row now, uh, but more on that tomorrow. We were just about to take off, go fly back to Lexand, and the plane kind of shuts off. There's a crack in the cockpit windshield, so long story short, we can't fly. We were, we're at a hotel right now in Alula. It's 1 a.m. Gonna try to get some sleep. 
travel back tomorrow. I don't even know what time. They haven't figured that out yet. So fly, fly back tomorrow, forced off day, I guess. And then it's another game day on Saturday. Wish I was home right now, but got to roll with the punches. So this is where Lexand is. Stockholm, Gothenburg, and all the way here is Lula and where we are. Game recap time from the snowy Lula. So 3-1 win, another three points, seven wins in a row. So this is a lot of fun right now. It was a little slower paced game. Um, a couple scoring chances here and there for both teams. Um, they ended up getting the first goal of the game at the end of the second period. What we got like pinned in our zone, uh, missed on a couple chances to clear the puck. Felt, felt like three minutes in our zone. Uh, they were able to kind of go behind the net, pass up front, one timer, kind of just crease the top of my pad, pounce top shelf, and with seven seconds left in the second, they, they got the one nothing lead. But then in the third, uh, Niels Almond with a six snipe got the things tied, and then Max Verano. Snuck 1-5 hole in the power play. And guys were blocking shots, doing a great job defensively, and Carter Camper finished it off in the empty net. Gotta give a shout out to uh, Lula's goal, Jesper Wallstead as well. He uh, he played a great game. He is Minnesota Wild's first round pick from this past year, I think. So uh, definitely when I'm long gone, retired, it'll be fun to uh, watch him play in the NHL and kind of say I uh, I at least beat him once. But yeah, good game. Um, back at it tomorrow. The like I said earlier, the reigning champs, Vexher, however you say it. Um, they're coming into Lexand to finish off the week. Just want to get home, relax, recharge for tomorrow. The next day, game day against Vexher. Um, Fox picked my game day outfit today: the hat, the shirt. The shoes and foxes in a game day mood with her jersey. High five. Okay, we're just going to daddy's game. It's our last day here. Actually, last hockey game here. Do you have anything to say? Mm -hmm. I'm daddy here. <gasps> Birds. <laughs> Birds. All right, we're going to take you guys to the game, and this is the last one. Can you say bye bye? Bye bye. Can you kiss? Good. Karlsson, Schelin, och det är mål! Det är 1-0 för Leksand! Rider, ja det är Kejloff är med! Kejloff i mål! Med 17,7 sekunder kvar av den första perioden. Andrew Kejloff. Rosén, ja det är en styrning ifrån Lyxell. Båset Holmberg i, men där blir det fler. Herman Aktell, och det är turen i mål, Nettinen. Växjö har öst på i den andra perioden, till slut kommer utdelningen. Direkt efter timeouten ifrån Leksand. Keiro, och så kommer läget för Forsberg, det är turen i mål! Leksand har kvitterat Oskar Lang. Blir det Lyxell, spelar Spott och Kaskiso. Herman Aktell. Och Kasimir Kaskiso som håller i.
Axel. Rosén. Robert Rosén. Får vi stå och släpper till Nettinen i mål. Hej, hej. Winning streak comes to an end at seven, and it's such a different feeling other than winning those games and then losing. And you know, it's harder to uh, harder to move on after a loss, but you always know there's a next game coming up. But at least our point streak is still going on. I think it's at 10 games right now that we've gotten points out of, so we're seven, oh, and two in the last 10. But I saw a lot of shots. I think uh, 46 shots against, which is by far the most I've had all year. Um, it's always a good feeling. You know, you feel you feel like you're in the game, uh, comfortable, not too much to think and stay warm. So I like that aspect of the game. First goal was like a two on one. Um, the guy who had the puck made a nice, nice pass. And I wish I could have gotten a better push, but second one, they uh, threw it from the point. There's a guy in front. They were high tipping shots all night. So I kind of had to uh, make sure that if he tips it, I'm solid. And then he came right through the guy on the screening and hit the pad. And uh, of course, went right on the tape on the, the guy on the par side and put in the empty net pretty much. So, and then they were able to uh, get the win in overtime but overall a pretty good week once again uh that's gonna do it for this week just want to thank you channel members once again i appreciate you make sure to click that join button to get all the perks and once again make sure to subscribe ring that bell for notifications and i'll see you next episode